Hey guys, BTR Plumbing here and today I'm with my 1955 Elger Duplex. So this is very similar to the Silenta except the Silenta has a different tank. But um, yeah, normally the Duplex or Silenta doesn't come with this tank so it might have been a replacement but it's from 1955 and same with the bowl. So um, I'm not sure but this is a Duplex but this is honestly a really cool toilet. It's still a little bit dirty. I had to restore it a whole bunch because I got this from an abandoned house and um, I'll tell you what, this thing was com almost completely black and there was a lot of stuff in the bowl that was really disgusting if you guys know what I'm talking about. So I probably won't be showing you what this looked like before because YouTube might get a little bit upset with it because <laughs> it wasn't, it's not pleasant to look at, I'll tell you that, but this thing cleaned up fairly nicely and it's still got a lot of work to do. But um, yeah, this video will probably be the next video of the 1975 Yellow Kilgore. Again, I really do like this toilet, so I'm glad I got it, but let me just plug the pump in right here and uh, let the tank fill up and then I'll give you guys a flush. Alrighty, and again, I do apologize if the water is a little bit dirty. I just cleaned it out, but there's still some dirt. As you can see, that is still down there. So uh, unfortunately, nothing in the tank is original except for the handle. And it's kind of weird. It's just like there's a screw that was put through there to hold the plastic chain on i don't know if you can see that or not it doesn't really want to focus that well but um and it does have a built-in overflow too but yeah here's a flush when it flushes all the water drains in the tank because if you see this once the water fills up in there and i'll show you now when you flush it that water actually holds it down so it allows all the water to empty out of the tank and it closes once all the water empties from that little um container there so i'm gonna do kind of like a half tank flush so well, let me let it fill a little bit more all righty here we go I really love the design of this toilet, especially with that little whirlpool jet there. I think it's really cool, or vortex jet, whatever you want to call it. Um, the bowl is a little bit dirty, so I apologize. It, it rained not too long ago, so it splashed up a bunch of mud, as you can see on all the toilet bowls. But yeah, um, and I'll give you a side flush like this. Here we go. Alrighty, so let's see. I'm gonna let the tank fill up. I'm gonna see if I can get almost all the water out of the bowl so when I flush it, you'll see the vortex jet. You might be able to see a little bit now. Let's see. Let's see if this will siphon. Alrighty, so now when I flush it, you'll be able to see all the water shoot out of the vortex jet. So let the tank fill a little bit more. Alrighty, here we go. I'm gonna hold the flapper open so as it's siphoning you can see the vortex jet. I think it's really cool. I mean, uh, I don't know who or like when they were making it, I don't know um, like why they thought to add it, but it's a little bit interesting, but I think, again, it's still pretty cool. And actually, there's no like separate water channel for it. It's just the normal siphon jet channel down the trapway. There's, they just punctured a hole, pretty much. So it, there's no special like water channel for it or anything like that. But here's another flush. I'll let the tank overfill this time. Alrighty, and here we go.
and wow that was a really long flush and i don't know if you're able to see that really well and sorry if my hair keeps getting in the way um once the tank overfilled and i flushed it the water actually went up to the rim so i can only imagine if you guys wanted i could probably put this on the flush armor setup if i could get a spud to fit or it would be really cool to see on a high tank so yeah let me let the tank overfill again just so i can show you the um the power of the bull rinse or the swirl and there's some text there it's not really readable but once i clean it you should be able to see that all right here we go as you can see it gets very close to the top of the rim All right, so let me fill up the bowl again really quickly. All righty, so again, uh, this thing did have a seat, but it wasn't original. And when I took out of the house, the seat was actually broken off. It was one of those like cheap Walmart $5 toilet seats. But um, again, this thing is still needs a lot of cleaning, but here's another flush. <laughs> back up but this is honestly a pretty cool toilet and if there's anything else you want to see with it let me know but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please like subscribe leave all your comments down below and i'll see you guys in the next video bye